Hello, good day, JB. I'm here again, your teacher, Malu. And um, my apologies because we couldn't finish our um, class a while ago because of my internet connectivity. And anyway, I'm now recording the video. And uh, this is module one. Uh, module one means the week one. Okay, mother tongue based multilingual education. So uh, I will try to I will try my best to uh, to translate. Okay, those uh, Visayan language into English because this is your preference. All right, are you ready? Okay, so here. <clears throat> okay, actually we we have started this a while ago, and I will. Uh, I will translate it again. Okay, so layi means try. Uh, direction A. Okay, direction A. This is uh, intro introduction, self introduction. Pangalan means name. So you're going to write your name here in the box. Okay, so for example, your name is. Uh, for example, my I will write my name. Okay. Malu. Okay. And my uh, family name, etc. Okay. And next, Natauhan means birthday. For example, I will write here my birthday, August. Okay. A while ago, you couldn't answer your birthday. Maybe you forgot or you don't know. Just ask your Mommy. Okay, JB. Okay, for example, my birthday is August 25, 1988. Okay. Okay, you also write like this. Okay. The pattern. Next, idad means age. Okay. Your age, you said a while ago, your age is six. So you can say, you can write six years old or six is okay. All right, next, JB. Let's move on to direction B. Lingini means in circle. In circle, the letter of your correct answer. Okay? Unsa ang makita sa atubangan sa libro? What can you see in front of the book? Letter A, ngalan sa libro or the name of the book. B, ngalan sa nagsulat or the name of the writer. C, the publisher or the owner of the book. Okay, so you you choose your correct answer and then encircle it. For example, for example, my correct answer is letter A. So you answer like this. Okay, but it doesn't mean the answer is letter A. Okay. Next, number five, ang mga bahin sa libro magbasa. Sorry, asa nga bahin sa libro mabasa ang ngalan sa publisher? So, which part in the book or which part of the book uh, we can see the name of the publisher or the owner of the book? Letter A, in front of the page or the front page. Letter B, the title page. Letter C, at the back of the page okay, or the back of the book. Alright, so choose your answer, A, B, or C, and then encircle it. Alright, next number three, pili a ang asa dinhi ang pulong. So you choose which, uh, which of these choices is the word. When we say word, only one. Okay, letter A, bag. Letter B, C, lito. Letter C, ang mga lapis ni Ana. Okay, so just encircle your correct answer. Number seven, pili a asa dinhi ang pulungan. So, as I've said, uh, let's just skip number seven and number eight. Okay, let's proceed to number nine. Okay, pili a ang nagaray sa pulung nga bao. So, you choose uh, which word that rhymes with the word bao. Letter A, basa. Letter B, bata. Letter C, bato. Okay, encircle your correct answer. Number 10, pili a or choose the uh, the word that rhymes with the word nagtongtong. Letter A, padulong. B, lunoy. C, adung. Alright. Okay, so next, 
let's move on to lection 1. Uh, paghisgot sa kaugalingon or tell yourself and your own experience, things, and your language. Panultihon. Okay? So, direction A, ipaila ang imong kaugalingon or introduce yourself by answering the question in the box. Okay, so number one, once again. Okay, so again, pangalan, you write your name. Natawhan, you write your birthday. Idad, you write your age. Ngalan sa mama or the name of your mother. Just ask your mommy what's her complete name. And then ngalan sa papa, ask your daddy his complete name. Okay, and write here in the box. Alright, next, let's move on to the next page. Discovery or discover. Okay, direction. You read. Uh, okay, let, let's read the poem. Okay, the title of the poem is Ang Akong Kaugalingon. Uh, in English, what's this? I myself. Okay, let me read for let me read first the uh, the poem. Okay, here it is. Ang akong kaugalingon, may pamilyang malinawon, nagbuhig irong itumon, nagkaon o prutas nga tamison, kauban sa akong igsuon bisag duwaan baratuhon, pero ako malipayon. Okay, so let's translate this. Again, the title is, I Myself. Okay, may pamilyang malinawon. Okay, there is a peaceful family. Nagbuhig irong itumon. So, they have a pet dog and the color is black. Nagkaon o prutas nga tamison. So, the pet dog is eating the fruit or the sweet fruit. Okay, kauban sa akong igsuon. Okay, uh, the, the dog is eating a sweet fruit with my sibling. Okay, and bisag duwaan baratuhon, even though our toy is not, uh, not costly or not expensive, pero ako malipayon but I am happy. Okay, that's the translation of this poem. Okay, so now let's move on to number one. Unsay imong ikasulti sa pamilya. What can you say about the family in the poem? A. Gubot or chaotic. Letter B. Palaaway or um, they always fight each other. Letter C. Malinawon or peaceful. Okay, just encircle your correct answer. Next, number two. Unsang mananap ang binuhi. Okay. What kind of animal uh, they take care or what is their pet animal? A. Iro or dog. B. Iring or cat. Letter C. Kanding or goat. Okay. Just choose your correct answer. Number three. Unsay iyang gikaon. What, what is the dog? What does the dog eat? Or what did the dog eat? Okay, letter A, puto. Puto is a rice cake. Letter B, prutas or fruits. Letter C, can, candy or candy. Okay, next, number four. Kinsay iyang kauban nagkaon sa prutas? Okay, who is its companion to eat the fruit? A, igsoon or sibling. B, ginikanan or parents. C, Silingan or neighbor. Alright, next, number five. Unsay gibati sa bata. What is the, what is the, uh, the kid? What's the feelings of the kid? A, magulanon or sad. Letter B, nasuko or angry. Letter C, malipayon or happy. Alright, okay, so next. Okay, so encircle the letter of your correct answer. Number one, unsa ang imong isulti kun kita magpailaila sa imong kaugalingon. What? Okay, what 
do you say when you introduce yourself? Okay. Uh, would you tell your name? Would you tell the place or would you tell about food? Okay, just encircle the correct answer. Next, number two. Unsa ang imong itubag kung pangutanon ka sa imong ngalan? Okay, what, okay, what will be your answer if somebody ask your name? Okay, would you say, ang ako ngalan kay si A. Iring or Cat B. Jose C. Balay or House Okay, choose the correct answer. Number three, unsay itubag sa pangutana nga? What will, you, what will be your answer if the question is, unsay imong binuhi? Okay, what is your pet? Ang akong binuhi kay, my pet is A. Manika or doll B. Iro or dog C. Prutas or fruit Okay, number four. Ang akong paboritong pagkaon kay blank. My favorite food is A. Iring or cat B. Libro or book C. Utan or vegetables Next, number five. Ang akong paboritong duwaan kay blank. My favorite toy is a. Bola or ball B. Pansit or noodles C. Payong or umbrella Alright, we're almost done Okay, here next Buhata, tubaga kining mga pangutana Okay, you answer this, these questions again Okay, JB, number one Unsa ang imungalan? What is your name? How old are you? Number three Where do you live? Number four, what is your favorite food? And number five, what is your favorite toy? Okay, next, uh, ipaila or introduce yourself and tell your experiences, your pets, your favorite food, your favorite toy, and your favorite experience. Okay, this is the last part. Okay, so, uh, okay, here, ako si, I am blank. For example, I am Malu. Aduna uh, koy binuhing, I have a pet. Okay, what is the name or what is, what kind of pet do you have? Next, blank, ang paborito kong sudan. Okay, for example, vegetables is my favorite food. Next, ang paborito kong duwaan. Okay, doll is my favorite toy. Next, malipayon akong I am happy okay, playing with my okay, with my friends. Okay, this time uh, Ati friends, you if, okay, you don't need to write JB's answer. All you have to do is just ask him verbally and uh, if he could answer completely, just draw a star here. Okay? So, when you submit the answer and I can see the star means uh, his performance task is perfect. Okay? Next, <clears throat> the last part, kumplituha or complete the statement. Tell if uh, gusto means if you like or you don't like. Ako si. Okay, so what's this? Ako si I am malu ang ako. Okay, so I think there is a conflict between the direction and the statement. So let's just uh, skip this this part. Okay, so that's the end of our module 1, MTB, and uh, I'll be waiting for the answer. And uh, once you, once you submit, submitted the answer, I will, uh, I, will sub, uh, I will send you right away the week 2. Okay, so thank you. Bye-bye, JB. See you next time.